behind it. He was behind it again. There you go. He's got it right there. I tight, tight. That was awesome. How's it going everyone? Kevin Blinkoff here from On The Water and today I'm going to talk about my five favorite Z-Man lures for striped bass. Z-Man makes a wide array of soft plastic lures. All feature Z-Man's Elaztec, so they're super stretchy, almost indestructible, and they've got such a wide range of lures, especially for saltwater options. All different options in size, shapes, so just kind of wanted to narrow it down to my personal five favorites. And the first one here, this is the Darter or the Darter Z. This is a newer bait from Z-Man. What I really like this for is for kind of like finesse type striper presentations. So backwaters, inshore, places where you want to cast that lands quietly, you don't want to spook fish. It has a thinner profile and it has a great segmented tail here. You can see the kind of fish shaped tail on the back as well. So you can rig this on a weedless offset worm hook, weightless, and it gives you that kind of great presentation, pretty light kind of the situation where you know you, you want to make sure you're not spooking fish, flats, inshore, and that would be my choice. And in this size, this will mimic silver side, sand eels, lots of inshore bait fish. So it's a great option for everything from schoolie size fish up to those 30 inch plus stripers. Next up, this would be my number four. Uh, this is the diesel minnow. And the diesel minnow is kind of a familiar classic swim bait shape that I think a lot of striper fishermen will recognize. And in the smaller size, this is the four inch, this is my go-to spring schoolie lure. So when striped bass first show up in the Northeast and you've got mostly smaller fish, you wanna go with a light jig head, a single hook, maybe even pinch down the barbs. This is a bait that you can go out and fish from the beach, fish from a jetty, and you could catch and release 30 schoolies on this lure and it's not gonna tear, it's not gonna get beat up. So this would be my choice, early spring, first arrival of the schoolies. Number three. So number three is a pretty new bait from Z-Man. This is their swim bait called the Hercules. And this has the internal lead weight and hook inside of it. Swim baits like this have been great striper lures for quite a few years now. What you're getting from the Z-Man version of this is a little more realism. You can see their scales, fins, eyes. It's got a lot of great action too. You've got this paddle tail, this kind of boot shaped paddle tail. And this is available in a number of weights and sizes. And again, it's Z-Man, so it's gonna last these are great for striped bass, but bluefish love them too, so you're gonna get some bluefish strikes on here, and that Z-Man Elastec will hold up to that. Number two, the Mag Swim. This is kind of my secret weapon in the Z-Man lineup. The Mag Swim is a paddle tail, so you've got the boot in the back, but it's a long, it's kind of a skinny bait. This is one that I like to, to put on the hook you see right here. It's a chin lock hook offset with a weight to it. So that gives it some weight that you can cast, the Z-Man Elastic floats, so between a little bit of weight and the floating, this is basically a topwater lure, it kind of balances out. And what I really like this lure for is for searching for fish. So springtime when I'm fishing in kind of shallow areas, when I, I know that fish are gonna be kind of looking up, fishing in bays, uh, targeting different structure, where I don't see fish breaking on the surface, but I know there's probably striped bass around, that's when I'll cast this. You can work it pretty much along the surface. That paddle tail works, you can create a V-wake behind it and splash. So I'm not trying to make this walk or do anything like that. To me, this is a search bait. Cast out, straight retrieve in. Done really well with this on striped bass and then also bluefish as well. And luckily that holds up just fine to the bluefish. And my number one in the whole Z-Man lineup, my favorite bait for striped bass is the Hero or the Hero Z. And this is a big bait, this is 10 inches. I like soft plastic stick bait type lures, that kind of classic striper lure. What Z-Man gives you in this though is a little bit different shape. It's a little broader. And then it's got this tail on the back. It gives it a little extra action. And to me, this is the ultimate striper bait. When big bass are on pogies, when they're on Menhaden, when no other artificial really seems to be able to pull them away from that natural bait, I've been able to get them to look at this bait and hit this bait. It has such a natural action for an artificial. You can work it with a twitch, you can make it kind of walk that way, you can let it die, and with the weighted hook and the floating Z-Man Elaztec, it makes it almost neutrally buoyant, it'll just kind of slowly sink if you've got it matched up right. Looks like a dying bait fish. This is the, the lure that I always have on board if I know I'm gonna run into big bass and I'm looking for big stripers. Rigged exactly like this, with the larger chin lock offset hook. To me, this is 
an ultimate big striper bait. And that's my top five picks from the Z-Man Lures, top five for striped bass. Give them a try. Definitely let me know in the comments which one of these you fished with, which ones you like. If you've got a different top five, let me hear it. Thanks for watching.